Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to NEPA Politics. I'm J. Donald Kazmersky here in uh, Dixon City, Pennsylvania. So last night on the 6th of September 2022, Oliphant PA had a council meeting. So this is a synopsis of the council meeting of some of the uh, important motions. Um, number one, they considered approval of uh, BIU as inspector for the residential rental unit ordinance inspections. Um, however, the borough ordinance had $50 per uh, unit and the BIU inspector in their contract wanted 65. So I guess the borough is going to somehow have to amend that ordinance to go to $65. Um, the borough manager wants that to begin next year. So if you have any comments on that, comment below. Um, the next important motion uh, Oliphant made was, or the council made was, the refuse collection approval of policy as to a maximum number of bags to be collected each week from each individual residential household. Um, they want the maximum of six bags per family, 33 gallons of bag, which is water gallons, but 15 pounds maximum per bag. Okay, so up to six bags per family. The next uh, big uh, um, motion council made was consider the approval of the MS4 pollution reduction plan. Um, as you know, <coughs> the Lackawanna River flows into the Susquehanna, the Susquehanna flows into the Chesapeake, and the federal government or the uh, Chesapeake Basin wants to reduce as much pop pollution as possible going into the um, Chesapeake Bay. Okay, um, so there is a plan. The, the pollution reduction plan is in the conference room for anyone who is interested in looking at it. It's posted in the conference room in the Elephant Borough Building. So if you are interested. Please look at it. Okay, another motion council made is considering the approval of a, res a resolution authorizing application for an LSA grant. Um, they want an $80,000 grant for the project downtown, which will include new um, digital parking meters, the kind that they have down in downtown Scranton. Okay, so new digital parking meters and a few other things, sidewalks, crossing, crossing uh, sidewalks as, as well. Okay, and then in the same, same vein, uh, consider approval of electric charging stations in the municipal parking lot off of Lackawanna Avenue. Um, what they want to do is have one base for two electric charging vehicles. So one charging station for two vehicles. Um, no Teslas, no Tesla charging station. It's just the regular other uh, vehicles, okay? At least they didn't say Tesla, Tesla type cars. <coughs> Alrighty, and the last um, big motion they made is they considered authorization, authorization for the borough to join Pliget, uh, PLGIT, uh, to invest uh, some money in a one-year CD. Uh, right now they're investing some money that's not even bringing 1%, and that's not only all of it, it's all the boroughs across uh, the state and everybody else probably in the country. Um, the Pliget interest rate is going to be 3.61%. Um, they'll invest that for one year, and if they need that money for uh, uh, a project or uh, emergency funds, then they could just write out a check and get that money out. Okay. So um, that'll be terrific. Okay, so that's it for the uh, lack of, for the uh, Oliphant Borough Council meeting. Uh, any comments or suggestions, please uh, do that below. Uh, and if you want to, please su subscribe as uh, always. Um, there's a separate video uh, on the garbage fee and the the new uh, tax or fee for the electric meters so i'm going to do a separate video on that it'll be short it won't be long but i'm going to do that right after this video all right uh thank you very much